Okay, now we're ready for the initial setup using the SXR program. So let's long click to radio setup, page to the SD card, scroll to the SXR, click that, and go to the SXR.lua, long hold, and execute. Now it's reading the parameters from the receiver. Wing type is normal. That can also be delta or VTAIL. We'll leave it normal. And the mounting type. This is basically horizontal. It can be up, down, a couple of configurations. Figure out how you're going to put it in the plane and set it appropriately. Now we're going to page over and there's a bunch of parameters. Okay, the very first thing is we want SXR functions enable. If you uh, disable, then the thing just works like a regular uh, receiver with no stabilization functions. Quick mode, we want to enable. Channel 5 and channel 6, it depends. If you're using extra servos, say for example like a second, uh, say like a second servo on the aileron or a second servo on your uh, tail, you need to set those to be uh, aileron 2 or elevator 2. But if you're using them for something else or not using them at all, just set those to aux 1 and aux 2 and then the stabilizer won't mess with those channels. So this is especially important if you've got, uh, say for example, landing gear and one of those might be gear up and gear down. Okay, we'll come back later and look at uh, some of these other parameters. The uh, direction is uh, for when you're doing reversing. We'll come back to that. And then there's some gain and offset values. Typically, you don't have to mess with those. Most people don't. But we might have to reduce the uh, one of these values having to do with auto level, uh, that it's a, the gain is a little bit high. Anyways, that's all you have to do. That's all transmitted down to the receiver and these values have been stored in the receiver memory.